don't use 102 to set up everything else. Who is Shintaro Fujinami and what does he bring to the Orioles? So Fujinami is a Japanese-born pitcher who's pitched eight years in the in the Japanese professional leagues before coming over this year in a one-year $3.5 million deal to the Oakland A's. He boasts a four-seam fastball that will run up to the 102-mile-an-hour range, a splitter that drops down to about 90 to 91, and a slurve that goes down to 84, along with a cutter that sits around 88. So he's got an arsenal of pitches to get guys out. Now, he started this year absolutely terrible with a 15 ERA as a starter. But since May 27th, moving to the bullpen, Fujinami has been lights out. So what are the Orioles expecting bringing in a guy like Fujinami? They're expecting him to kind of take over that middle relief role, that that role right now where they don't have between starter and Yunir Cano. That role right now that they're trying to make Mike Bauman work or Perez or Baker and you're getting okay innings out of these guys every so often, but they need that guy that's going to shut the door to get to Cano. You know, they are looking at Fujinami with that high-velocity fastball, the plethora of pitches that, that can just turn the page and get to Cano, right? So one thing I do notice about this guy is his fastball is very flat. But this sequence here will show you. I think he knows his stuff is flat, right? He can get a, a ball moving at 88 there on a cutter. And then look at this pitch, right? That sinker dropped about six inches at 94, and then he comes back with the heat. So he can build off of that. So we're not going to sugarcoat it here. Fujinami was absolutely terrible as a starter, right? But the, the last 10 outings, he's zero walks, right? That's, that's huge for the Orioles. Zero walks and 12 Ks. He's still giving up four runs, right? We've talked about that flat fastball. I think the Orioles are going to look at him as a guy that, okay, say, hey, Fujinami, you're going to throw your cutter, you're going to throw your sinker, and then you've got that curveball. Let's work off of that. It's a 95-mile-an-hour sinker, right? Picture Zach Britton again. Picture Jose Bat- I mean, no, Felix Batista right now with that splitter. Dude's got a 90-mile-an-hour splitter. Build off of your 102 and use those pitches to set that up. Don't use 102 to set up everything else because that's how you get hit hard in the AL East. 